I'm Jamie, and in this video, I'll be showing you how to create wireless uplinks using Unify APs. This requires two or more Unify APs already adopted into a controller running version 2.0 or later. In later versions of Unify 2.3, it may be necessary to set a manual channel assignment in order for the wireless uplink to work. Visit the radio configuration page of both the wired and wireless UAP and set them both to the same channel. Then hit apply. They will quickly provision and reboot. Once back online, you may disconnect the wireless UAP and place it where you'd like in the physical environment. Next, you'll need to wait for the controller to recognize that the AP has disconnected. This usually takes about five minutes. After a few minutes, the controller will report that the disconnected AP has missed a heartbeat. Keep waiting until the AP appears as disconnected. Once the AP successfully disconnects, you can set it to wirelessly uplink to a connected AP. The AP will begin readopting and shortly thereafter connect wirelessly. After it finishes its uplink, a small wireless icon will appear next to the AP. Each wired AP can make up to four wireless downlinks. Thank you for watching this video.